Hello my dreamers, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nancy, thank you so much for watching. I am in a different place right now. I am currently in my bathroom um, and I am going to be doing something different and that is coloring my hair. As you can see, I've had my blonde hair for quite a while now. I kind of want to change it up, um, especially since I'm in quarantine. I am not a hairdresser, so I don't know how to professionally color my hair or cut my hair or anything. Um, but since I am in quarantine, I might as well try to attempt this myself. I've seen a lot of people just do it themselves as well, so why not, right? I am going to be using um, this brand called Arctic Fox. So I don't know if you guys have heard of this brand before, but this is a brand owned by Kristen Leanne. She is like a beauty influencer, but she also um, has like really nice colorful hair. So today's color, I am going in with this Arctic Mist Diluter. So this is just supposed to be like the big, the base. Um, it doesn't do anything to your hair specifically. This one is in virgin pink. So I'm so sorry for the bad lighting. I am in my bathroom, so I'm only going off of whatever lighting is in here. Um, and then this one is Arctic Fox Neon Moon. I'm just going to be adding a little bit of that as well. I also bought another one. This is Transvania. It's just a black color, so whenever I want to go back to black hair, I'll just use this. I'm really excited. I'm trying to go for a rose gold color, so let's just see if I can achieve that. So, yeah, if you guys want to see me dye my hair today, then you know the drill. Keep on watching. This is the Arctic Mist Diluter, and I'm going to put this first. This is probably going to be like the most because this is supposed to be what mix the colors together. I honestly, I'm just going to eyeball it. I don't know how much I'm supposed to put, but what's really cool about um, the Arctic Fox's Instagram page, they actually tell you what color you need to put together to create like, you know, the color that you want. So for me, rose gold, um, I was going to go with the version pink. I guess I'm just going to eyeball this. I bought a tiny bottle of this one because obviously it's a neon moon, it's this color, which I'm not planning to do my hair this color much. It's really hard to do with one hand. This is the best that I got the um, color. It looks a little bit more pink, but on the camera it looks a little bit more rose gold. Um, but let's just try it out because I feel like I keep mixing it over and over and over and I just feel like it's just gonna overflow so yeah I'm just going to keep this color I'm gonna do a strand test and just see um, how it's gonna look so I did a strand test but I don't think I can wait that long so I'm just going to start doing all my hair I know I'm so impatient but yeah um, this is the pink that it's turning to so yeah, wish me luck. I don't know how I'm gonna be able to do all my hair. Um, so, yeah, we shall see how this goes. Alright, so I need to make another batch because I am pretty much done with this. Alright, so I feel like this next batch looks a little bit more rose gold. So, yeah, I'm a little worried. It might be like uneven, the color. So, uh, I don't know. We're just gonna roll with it because I'm not really even like a hairdresser. So, I don't even know what I'm really doing. Let's just go ahead and do what we can. All 
right, so I just finished coloring the rest of my hair. And I'm just gonna be waiting for like 45 minutes maybe, and then I'll wash it off and we'll see how it turns out. All right, so I actually got this shower cap and I'm just putting my hair in it just so there's some heat in it or something, I don't know. I mean, I just see people do this all the time. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna be here waiting for this to um, soak in and then I'm going to wash my hair and we'll see the results. I'm a little bit scared that it might not turn out evenly, but this is my first try, so we'll see how it goes. All right, and this is how my hair turned out. As you can see, it does look pretty patchy. Um, and as you can see, this side looks a little bit darker than this side. I think like I, when I was saying in the beginning, um, I did feel like the first bowl that I made was a little bit more pink. And the second one was a little bit more rose gold, which was what I was trying to go for, this type of color. Um, but the bottom part was the first bowl that I did, which is a little bit more pink. But I really do like the way everything um, kind of just came together. Like, I like the way that all of these pinks mix in with my blonde still. You can kind of see some of my blonde and obviously the black part here of my hair, Just it just... I thought it would at least tint a little bit, but it didn't really. Um, so yeah, um, this is my hair, you guys. And I like it for now. I might just fix it a little bit more um, as the weeks go by. If it starts fading, I'll probably add a little bit more um, over or on top of it. I'll probably have my girlfriend help me as well because it's pretty patchy as you can see. Um, but yeah, overall, I think I would just rock with it for now and we'll see where it goes But yeah, thank you all so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope this inspires you all to try something new with your hair um, We are in quarantine right now, so why not? Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are having a great day wherever you guys are If you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel So you can be a part of my family here on YouTube and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye